Hi everybody, it's Lance and it's snack o'clock somewhere. Today we're gonna make our, uh, a new broth tail for you. This is called the Old Smoky Fashioned and this is, uh, it's a really nice one. It's gonna use a couple of interesting ingredients. Again, these are perfect for just in between, let's say lunch and dinner, maybe even at evening, because there's gonna be some bold flavors here. So the first thing we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna use our spicy tortilla sipping broth, and this is going to be the base for, for the broth. We got that in there. I got my hot water all ready to go. And again, remember only eight ounces of hot water. I've got this pre-measured uh, at that point, which is eight ounces. And then we're gonna get that going. Again, that's four minutes of steeping, just to make sure that we get enough flavor. The next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take a, a blood orange. The blood oranges are really nice. They've got some interesting flavors. And we're gonna do two things with it. Um, first off, we're gonna, I'm gonna cut it, not too thick of a slice, but then I'm gonna cut this in, in half and I'm going to um, scrunch that a little bit here, get some of the juice out there, but I'm gonna put it right into the water and I'm gonna let that rind cook a little bit with the, the hot water as it's steeping through, through the tea bag. Now, the next thing I'm gonna do, I've got a little green onion here, so the green onion is, is um, gonna help us kind of um, bold up the flavor. It also gives you something interesting to um, to chew on. Sometimes at the end of the uh, drinking the broth, you know, you want uh, just a little bit of texture. And uh, for those of you who are watching your your calories, if you're doing fasting or something like that, it's not going to kill you. There's, there's probably one calorie in the whole thing. And then the next thing, we've got a basil leaf. I just got the basil leaf out of my yard, and so I'm going to put that in. I'm going to do a quick little cut like this and put that in. And then the last thing I'm going to add is our smoked za'atar blend. This has got some really bold flavors. Uh, you know, give that a quick dash. It's got some sesame seeds in there like that. And so while that's cooking, I think we're at uh, almost three minutes now. While that's cooking, I'm going to start stirring it up, and uh, it's really important to give the broth bag a quick little squeeze there. While I'm doing that, I'm going to slice the blood orange, put it on here so it looks really pretty. So you can see that. Looks pretty nice, huh? Looks nice. Look at that. All right. We've got... I think we're right at the end of the steep now, and you can tell <clears throat> the water is uh, uh, looks like it's got all the flavor out of there. I'm gonna again. I just want to demonstrate. Now, don't do what I'm just doing, which is take the tea bag out. It's really hot, but I'm showing you this because if you can see as I'm squeezing it out, oops, there's a lot of flavor still in there. So I leave the tea bag in while I'm drinking it. All right. So we are done. This is this is it. I'm gonna give it a little taste. Mm, that's good. Got a little um, chewy of the onion here. Mm. <laughs> it's good. Um, and as you drink it, everything's gonna keep cooking in there, and the flavors are gonna get deeper and deeper. So thank you, and it's our duty to please a foodie.